Hello everyone, this is Tea Junkie and welcome to tutorial number 4. In this tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to make a ladder in Half-Life 2 Episode 2 and any of the Half-Life 2 series. It's different using it in Cowstruck Source and it's also different in Left 4 Dead 1 and 2. It's a lot more simpler. Right, the first thing you want to do is you want to create a hole or a ledge wherever you want the ladder going up to. I'm just going to create a quick quick room. with a ledge I'm going to climb up to. You generally can do ladders however high you want them. For this tutorial I'm just going to do it a wall's height. Right, when you've got your ledge all set up, what you want to do is you want to create a prop underscore static. I'll just type that in for a minute. In a minute. There we go. Create the entities tool. Prop underscore static. If you've made one out of a brush, it's fine but I find that models tend to do the better job of it. See, I go double click on it, go world model, and then click browse. And you will type in ladder, and search for what ladder you would like in your level. I quite like that model. So I'm going to use that. Now what you want to do is you want to line it up where you want it in your map. So once you've got it all lined up, you're going to need a few entities now. You're going to need a you want to use you want to it funk usable ladder I'm going to place it down place it as centered to the prop as you can once you've got that in if you scroll into the middle of it you'll see a little circle what you want to do is you want to click on the circle and then drag it up to the height to, to just above your ladder the same height as your floor as you can see I've got it there and connecting them both you'll see a ye little yellow line right now what you need to create is a info underscore ladder underscore dismount. You place these wherever you want your character to dismount the ladder, which direction you want them to dismount the ladder on. I'm only going to use two. So I put one there. And then I'm going to place another one down here. By the side. Once you've got that in, what you need to do is make sure your levels, you've got all textures in your level. I'm just going to throw some concrete floor together and some walls. And add a ceiling.
and just got all that in make sure you've got sufficient lighting I'm just going to copy and paste the light I had in my corridor from the earlier tutorial and place it where you want that light I'll have it there now when you've got the, all that in and your level sealed off you want to compile the map press F9 or this icon up here make sure your the checkbox is ticked for don't run the game after compiling and everything's on normal what we're going to do now is we're going to go compile the map once your map's compiled you'll get this window pop up copy to clipboard and now what you want to do is you want to launch your game if you haven't got it loaded already let me just load that now now the game's loaded what you'll need to do is you'll need to go into the console which is accessed by the button above tab if you don't know how to enable the console please check my tutorial too it has all you need to know on how to activate the console in game right now you need to do is type map and then tut1 or whatever you called your level and then hit enter Right, pick up your weapons if you've got any spawned, and you come to your ladder, and you go up and down it, and you'll dismount at the points that you put down. Sounds already included, you don't need to do much than what I've taught you. It's that simple. Thank you for watching my tutorial. Please subscribe to my channel and give me comments. Thank you very much for watching. Bye.